I do. You know, fit. Hey, you going to the bonfire tonight? Sounds like fun, right? Seriously, Stephanie, leave me alone. All right, you think I'm annoying now? Wait till homecoming. Hey, who are you bringing, by the way? I don't want it to be something weird. I'm sorry. Watch it, dick. Who are you? I'm the guy who's been assigned to protect a human blood bag. I mean, no facts or anything. What? Excuse me. Elena, hi. What are you doing? I'm having fun, Stefan. You have a problem with that? All right, take it easy. Both know you're kind of a lightweight. <laughs> really? You think I'm gonna let a blood addict tell me how to drink? Flirt on and I'm jealous. I'm not jealous. It's all right, be jealous by all means. I'm sure Dame will be thrilled. I'm not jealous, Stefan. It's my mistake. Whatever. I'm out of here. <clears throat> Anything? No. Sorry. Actually, I think you were coming from that direction because I remember looking that way. So maybe if we switch. Sure. Okay. <clears throat> this is, it's just that seeing you like this is so strange. I'm strange. You were the one coming out of the men's bathroom. Do I even want to know why? <laughs> Let's just say that I was having a pretty horrible first day. Close your eyes. You close your eyes. Come on, Stefan. Trust me. All right. This isn't awkward. I guess we probably picked the wrong day to be in a fight, huh? You couldn't cook. And you could. Again, a fantasy. <laughs> Breakfast, Professor Salvatore? Oh, no, 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 no. I see what you're doing. What am I doing? Distraction tactics. Stay focused. So. Psychology, sociology, and anthropology share the assumption that... Scientific methods can be used to understand human behavior. That's very good. As in verbatim. Which means that I need to ask you more difficult questions. <laughs> Speaking of distracting tactics... You're welcome. Hey, I'm sorry I'm late. What'd I miss? Just that Stefan's the tutor from hell? Unkind. Take that back. Probably read you a nice little bedtime story. Stop it. <laughs> you're the least helpful person I know. For a couple so your system for moving on requires both burning bridges and a dead end job. We haven't even gotten to the fun part. Paying your utilities? No. Deciding who you want to be for the next 30 years. You want to be an astronaut? You want to be a, an Olympic <laughs> athlete? You want to skip med school? Boom! You're a doctor. Go ahead, challenge me. I'll show you how it's done. All right, let's see what you got. Okay. Elena Williams. <gasps> Stephen Cooper, what are you doing? We've known each other for a very long time now, and you've always been my best friend. I have always loved you, and I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Will you... Wait! You're not just proposing to me because I'm pregnant, are you? No. 
No, I, I am proposing to you because you are my rock, okay? You have stood by my side through the multiple rehabs, the jail time, the bullfighting injury. I mean, you have brought me back from the edge. And sweetheart, this baby is the best thing that ever happened to us. Will you marry me? Oh. Yes. Uh -huh. yeah. Thank you all so much. And I think we could have all been sitting around stuffed playing board games. So just to be clear, Joe was invited to Friendsgiving, but I wasn't. Friend code states that in matters such as yours and Caroline's, I must, with no exception, take the side of my best friend. Huh. But can you two just kiss and make up? It's getting weird. You're just mad because no one knew how to carve the turkey. <laughs> you owe me dinner. People are uncomfortable around Salvatore's and Tuxes. It stirs feelings. Uh-oh. Lana's human again. Am I sensing another brother swap? <laughs>